Today I wake up a little bit after 9 a.m., which is kind of late. I have this week off, so I've been sleeping in. I have a few light errands to run today, and I'll be bringing the iPhone 13 Pro with me. But first, it's time to brush my teeth. I grab my things at around 10 a.m., and today I have to quickly get to the Apple store to get things done. So I go to Sherway Gardens in Toronto. So the time is now 10.33. I didn't use the phone much. I used it for like GPSing and playing Spotify for about half an hour in the car. So I'm currently at 91% battery life, which is pretty good. It's not too bad. I mean, the way I've been using it, again, was using it on cellular. I'm at the mall right now. I gotta go in to do something and then I'll be right back out. Let's quickly go into the mall and I'll be back. I just went to the mall to the Apple store and they told me that for what I wanted to do, it's gonna be about one more hour. So I'm gonna head to Starbucks, get some coffee, get refueled and get that started. This is the front camera on the iPhone 13 Pro. You can see the quality. I'm in a car right now, so it's kind of dark. Uh, it's not like the best exposure, but you can see how it looks if you're filming in any type of environment. So yeah, let's get some coffee. I am craving a coffee, but I kind of want to sit and drink it and enjoy it. However, everything is closing down their dine-ins due to the pandemic. While waiting for my appointment, I sit in the car and browse through social media and check emails. After I leave the Apple store, I figure there's a cool park nearby where I can kind of test out the camera. I also come here about once a year to catch the views and get fresh air near the water and to just reflect. It's a really cool place in Toronto. While I'm here, I search up any local cafes nearby as I'm supposed to have a conference call with my video production partner. Unfortunately, there is none nearby, like nothing is open, they're all closed. There's nowhere for me to dine in, so I'm gonna head back to a cafe closer to my home. Okay, so the time is now 12.04. I have a few things to do. I gotta call my video partner, but I want to go to Starbucks, but it was close and I have to find a cafe close enough. But in the meantime, I'm gonna stop at a park just to relax a bit. It's the end of the year. I gotta reflect on a few things. It's kind of cold, but let's look at the view quickly. Yeah. And over there, I don't know if you can see, but that is the CN Tower all the way down there. You probably can't see it, but it is the CN Tower right there. And yeah, uh, the iPhone 13 battery is, let's see what the battery is at. Uh, 12.04. Again, I just used it lately today. I was doing some GPS, basic stuff. Uh, the time is 12.04 and the iPhone is at 73%. So, I mean, it's not that crazy, but it's only 12 o'clock. I have a long day ahead of me where I have a lot more battery life. All right, let's go. Okay, so I just came from the park and I figured that I could come to this cafe and get some work done. And I came here and this cafe is closed. I'm so upset. It's closed. Look. So I don't know if it had to do with the pandemic and what's going on, but they are closed. So look, I went to like three different cafes. All of them are not doing in-person dining. So that means I'm gonna have to go to uh, my crib, go back to the house and uh, just do the work that I gotta do there. I did. I was kind of hoping to do it outside the house, but these are the times we're living in. So I'll see you guys at home. I get home at around 2 p.m. and spend some time browsing the web on my 2021 MacBook Pro. I also take the time to FaceTime my video partner so we can talk about an end of the year video that we're working on. After the call, I spent some time working on the video that I was just chatting to him about. And I'm also gonna use the iPhone 13 Pro to do some things like browse social media some more, uh, check my emails, and also write a script for this video. Cutter, 
Okay, so I was just editing for, I don't even know how long it's been, a couple of hours, I'd say probably an hour and a half. I've just been doing a bunch of random things with the phone as well, including texting and uh, checking social media, checking the news, because there's been some big pandemic updates in Canada lately or Ontario lately. I want to give a quick little wrap up and summarize my thoughts. So quick first thing, I do want to show the battery uh, life that I had. So I had seven hours and one minute screen on time and I basically spent a lot of the time using GPS, Instagram, camera, messages, and the battery is at 24%. 24%. So I think that's pretty damn good. I mean, I was in and out on LTE, also on Wi-Fi. You can count on this phone to last you all day, especially if you're gonna be in and out. Now, what I should say is that when I'm inside, I don't necessarily have to worry about charging this phone, but I was out and about and doing like a few things. So it did kill the battery a little bit faster than my normal use. But if you're somebody that's on the go, you are gonna wanna pick up a charger with this thing. That pretty much is it. Good phone, good camera. You can see the samples. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys have any questions, drop them down below in the comments. I do make sure to respond. I'm gonna see you guys in the next one. Peace.